Hello you guys, welcome to my channel, The Molly Spoken 22. My name is Nadi. This channel is for adults only. Please like, comment, subscribe if you guys like my reading, if you guys like my vibe. Alright, help me grow, we can grow together. So this is a general reading for my Aries, okay? Take what fit, leave what doesn't. Don't force anything into your life, Aries. If you have to ask who, what, when, where, how, why, then that means that the reading is not for you. I do curse on my channel, so if you don't like the cursing areas, you can always move to another channel. Alright? I hope everyone is doing lovely today. So this is going to be a reading with about what this person wants to say to you. Alright? Let's hop into some energy. Oh, let's hop into this energy, you guys. What does this person want to say to my Aries? Spirit, let us know what this person has to say to my Aries. What does this person want to say to Aries, Spirit? I remember every detail of that day. So whatever day that you remember, this person remembers as well. So it could have been a day that you guys had like an argument. Or it could have just been a special day that you guys shared that you will always remember. But whatever that day is, that person remembers that Aries. What else do this person wants to tell my Aries? I will wait for a sign from you. So this person is waiting to hear from you. Maybe you could have this person blocked. Maybe you block communication with this person from your phone, your social media. But whatever this this situation is, this person is waiting for a sign from you. All right. It's like they're hoping and praying that you reach out to them at this point. They could. I feel I'm getting like they got so much to say to you. This person wish they would have treated you better. They wish they would have treated you better. You guys could have been in a long-term committed relationship, Aries. Maybe this person put you in a third-party situation. Whatever the case is, we will get to some clarifiers here. But this person definitely wish they would have treated you better in this situation. Okay? They definitely wish they would have treated you better. So we're going to get some clarifiers from uh, the tarot cards here. If you guys like my reading so far, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Spirit, clarify I remember every detail of that day. Clarify I remember every detail of that day. Give me more on I remember every detail of that day. Yeah, this person could have gotten caught up in a third party situation. Maybe you seen this person out hanging with this person and looking bad or something. But I feel like that's what it is. I feel like you seen this person somewhere out with the third party looking bad. Okay, maybe this person um didn't they maybe they seen you, all right, and you didn't see them. Okay? I feel like this person was a player, okay? And this person could have definitely been in some type of long-term whole situation and i feel like this person could have gotten exposed by you for dealing with multiple people here okay being very careless i feel like this person was definitely in some type of player energy here all right and and they were very in and out your life and i feel like when they did reunite with you at one point all right the third parties were exposed and i feel like that's the day that they remember maybe this day could have caused you guys some type of argument Clarify, I will wait for a sign from you. Clarify, I will wait for a sign from you. Clarify, I will wait for a sign from you, spirit. So, yeah, this person will wait for a sign from you. They, they're they waiting for you to take a leap of faith towards them. Okay? Um, maybe they're not knowing if you're going to be combative with them. Maybe wanting to argue with them. Okay, so they're going to wait, wait for a sign from you. So that way, when you take the leap of faith... That's going to be on your terms, knowing that you're wanting to recover the situation. Right now, they're afraid to reach out to you because they feel like you're going to cuss their ass out. 
clarify i wish i would have treated you better yeah this person wish they would have treated you better this person wish they could turn back the hands of time and give you new love this person wish that they can go back and just fix everything or just erase all of the fucked up shit that they did i feel like this person has accepted what they have done but these options that they are with they have grown bored and tired of these options and they want your love all right and they definitely wish they would have treated you better because like i said you got this person blocked and they're missing you they're mad about this yo you release this person because they were dealing with multiple options maybe not helping you with the children all right and you call judgment on their ass all right and you have cut this out because of the third party situation third party heartbreak all over this baby but i feel like you know you're you're moving on from this healing yourself recovering all right i feel like you have gotten some maybe they have gotten some type of sense assessment all right have gotten some type of awakening of you know that they want to recover this with the family you guys could have had a family dynamic with children involved in this all right families maybe you guys were married mother-in-laws sister-in-laws father-in-laws brother-in-laws whatever the case may be this person has realized that you are their home and they want to recover they want you to come to them with open arms that's why they're waiting on on a sign from you because you have released this person all right you are you have been the queen of swords on their ass but we're going to get some advice here And then I'll be out with the reading, Aries. My little feisty little somethings. <laughs> Spirit, what's the energy for my Aries? What's some advice? Give us some advice. Balance is needed in this situation. All right, so I'm feeling like you definitely need some balance here. You got too much fire. You need to balance yourself out. You could have been dealing with the water sign here. All right, but Spirit wants you to make sure all of your relationships are equal and balanced with giving and receiving. If they are out of rhythm, then the other is sacrificing and can't sustain itself. Therefore, it will create more obstacles to overcome. Know you are worthy and deserve respect in all ways. So, it's like a Libra scale. Alright? Make sure it's balanced. When it comes to giving... When, it, when things get unbalanced because you are doing too much, it's more um giving than receiving then you need to figure out what resonates with you and your in your energy and what doesn't okay because you are worthy of the world you are a queen you are a king all right and you deserve respect in all areas of your life no matter what it is and at work love home family you deserve that so definitely balance yourself out here um, you know, get, do that. Do an analyzation on your life. What's, what's giving? Who's giving more and who's taking? Okay. But that was just a quick little energy check in for Aries. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Help me grow, you guys. We can grow together. We can become a tribe. And until next time, bye, Aries.